So I just got done watching the Stepfather movie trailer. This film was based on a true story. Back in the 1950s, a man named John List murdered his wife and kids and married into another family with no father and he was eventually caught. The movie's on a similar basis. The movie in 1987, the original, which stars Terry O'Quinn, does a very good job. I saw this movie a long time ago. I know he did a good job. I can't honestly say I love the film as a whole, but I would say it was a decent movie for the 80s. The question is, will this one be better because most remakes are not better. So the plot of this movie is that their son Michael returns home from military school to discover that his mom has has a new man living with her who's her boyfriend. She eventually marries and you know he's obviously trying to get along with the son and then he just starts being very suspicious and a lady comes to the door, uh, next, you know, a neighbor, and she, uh, says that she's, she was watching America's Most Wanted, and there was a picture of a guy who looked like, you know, the stepfather, and as the, you know, as the trailer goes on, you see that he is crazy, and obviously they were correct, he is the, he is the guy, and that's pretty much what happens, they just have to deal with him being a psychotic nutball. The thing about this film, you know, granted I've just seen the trailer so I haven't seen the whole movie, but it does resemble a lot of films that I've seen recently. You know, especially two specific ones, which would be one recently which was called Disturbia, which starred Shia LaBeouf, which was a very good movie. It, it was very suspenseful. The other movie I think resembles it the most is a movie called Domestic Disturbance, which was also not a bad film, but it's almost the same story. In the movie Domestic Disturbance, which stars Vince Vaughn as the, you know, scary guy, John Travolta as the good guy, is about the young boys, you know, his parents are split up, you know, she meets a new guy, which is Vince Vaughn. You know, he's a rich guy, you know, he seems cool. And then, you know, you start to notice that he's crazy. And then he kills a guy, the son witnesses it. And it's just, it just sounds like a familiar story because it's about a stepfather. It's about that he's a psycho, that he, you know, lives another life. He, he has killed people, he's been in jail. That's why it seems like a very familiar story to me. Now, I'm not saying that this movie won't be good. It, I don't see it doing extremely well at the box office, but I bet it'll be interesting to watch. I am a fan of Dylan Walsh, however, who plays Sean McNamara on Nip Tuck, which is Nip Tuck is one of my favorite shows, and so I'm, I'm pretty sure I'll enjoy watching it. I don't know, I mean, this film is either going to be really lame because you're going to be able to you know, guess every single point that's going to happen, which I hate. Like with Disturbia, yeah, there have been other films that are somewhat resembling it, but all the suspenseful parts, you know, I wasn't expecting them. I think this movie will be entertaining, decent, hopefully all the suspenseful points will be kind of unexpected in a way but hopefully it will be entertaining I'm definitely gonna go see it I'll definitely do a movie review so you'll be able to know my opinion on it but I wanna know what what do y'all think do you think this movie is gonna be pretty much a domestic disturbance too cuz I've, I've seen a couple people you know kind of say that or do you think it's going to be different enough to where you'll enjoy it on a different level? What is y'all's opinion?